Here's two things that will make you the most successful kid in your school. They say that uh, 60% of the time, no. Are you tired of waking up in the morning and realizing you're nothing more than half-baked chicken dog water? <laughs> <laughs> The two things that will change the game for you. I don't want to make this sound too much of a guarantee, but this is going to make you successful, period. First thing, self-education. I've said it before, and I'll say it again. But I'm going to pair that with the second thing. And this is what's really going to be the game changer. Because self-education of in and of itself, knowledge is potential power. Knowledge is not power. Knowledge isn't going to do anything for you if you don't do anything with it. The second thing is immediate action. So you're gonna pair self-education with immediate action. Those two things paired together will absolutely change the game for you. Never stop learning. The idea is to create and cultivate a motivation and a desire to continue to want to learn. And surprisingly, the way to do that the way to continue learning and to hunger for more and more exponentially is to actually do it. So that's where the immediate action comes in. If you have an amazing idea that you think of, something that you know that you should do, stop whatever you're doing and do that thing right away. I fell into the trap of immediate action and I would think of a really good idea, something I knew that I should do, and I would go and I would set a reminder on my phone. This is like the biggest trap that you can fall into. For me, I was like, this is it, man. Weeks would go by, and trust me, that thing would get put on snooze more times than a homie could count. One thing that is really, really cool that I actually recommend you do is go to the voice memos on your phone and build out a folder or just start recording and basically start recording and just talk about the idea. Talk about whatever it is and really flesh out whatever you want to do, whether that's building a business, uh, starting a side hustle, whatever it is that you are wanting to do, whatever that idea is, if it's a hobby that you've wanted to get started, take some form of action, right? Flesh it out so that it's more than just a thought that comes in your head and just leaves. Let's take an example. What if Jeff Bezos had a great idea and he founded Amazon.com? Think about if he hadn't. I mean, he literally changed the world of e-commerce as we know it. You might not want to found the next Amazon.com or world-changing company or business, but maybe you want to start a local company and actually help out some people in your local community or go and start a fundraiser worldwide, globally, and help uh, you know a certain cause or organization that you believe in. You know, Whatever that mission or vision that you have, freaking go for it like just absolutely go for it so that's where that immediate action comes in how is this applicable to a kid in, in middle school and high school same exact thing it really doesn't change whether you're 30 40 80 or 10 or 20 really doesn't matter it's a matter of taking action so go do that thing that business that you want to start go start that side hustle go start investing go open a robin hood account do whatever it is that you have been wanting to do. I promise you'll be more successful because of it. And if you truly do this, if you really focus on self-education, and you're constantly and consistently taking immediate action and not allowing any room for excuses or let-ups, you will 100% become the most successful kid in your school. You'll have all the homies being like, this guy, this kid, we never expected that one. And that's gonna feel, it's gonna feel good. Wrapping this video up, wanted to keep it short and sweet and really make it something that it would really change, truly change your life if, if you do take action on it. So please, you know, take, take a few things. I really hope that you got something out of this video. I don't wanna leave you with nothing. Uh, so there's actually a couple books that I'm going to uh, recommend to you. There's three books, and I'm gonna list them all right here. First off, The Defining Decade by Meg Jay. 
this is about your 20s and why it's the most important decade of your life. Second book is Pound the Stone by Joshua Metcalf. This book, I can not say enough about it. It is absolutely amazing. It's just a real story about the process of becoming great and how it's not pretty, it's not attractive, it sucks for the most part, right? It's, it's dirty hard work, that's the reality of it. And then the last one, So Good They Can't Ignore You by Cal Newport. This was a really, really cool book and it's very self-explanatory. So that's those three books that I do recommend for you. And again, I truly, sincerely hope that this did help in some small way, whether it was so entertaining to you or you truly found value in it. Uh, if you did, it'd be cool if you tap, tap that like button for the, uh, the glorious YouTube algorithm. <laughs> On that note, thank you everybody for staying tuned, being patient with me. We'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.